Everybody knows about Frankenstein, right? A thunderclap roars, clamps screech, a green corpse jolts, and a cry pierces the night. The Frankenstein is born. However, this fairy tale of old may no longer even be a fable, as recent breakthroughs have poised humanity on a path to recreating life's most complex systems. This path hits close to home because glaucoma has left its mark on my own family. And now, life isn't being built with stitched together limbs, but with lab-grown organoids. But what are they? These miniature organ-like cell cultures mimic the structure and function of human organs, turning a flat petri dish into a living, evolving mini-universe of human biology. These aren't just blobs in a dish. They're made from stem cells, the body's ultimate shapeshifters. In 1907, biologist H.V. Wilson tore sponge cells apart. Like tiny Frankensteins, they reassembled on their own, using adhesion proteins and signaling pathways to recognize and reconnect. Now, we use pluripotent stem cells, shape-shifting potions that can become any tissue from the three germulators. With the right chemical formulas, scientists coax these cells into folding, layering, and specializing until tiny tissues emerge. Brain organoids spark with electrical activity while retinal organoids can sense light, both no larger than a grain of rice. And it's not just lab magic, real patients have benefited as well. At John Hopkins, scientists grow retinal organoids from patient stem cells to study blinding diseases. For families like mine facing glaucoma, these mini retinas are more than science, they're hope in our hands. They reveal how your body, not the average body, responds to treatment, paving the way for personalized medicine. So, from Mary Shelley's monsters to pea-sized organoids, our tools have changed, but the goal hasn't. To redefine what's possible, not with lightning, but with science and compassion.